I think sustainability is one of those over, overused terms, actually. I think sustainability um, starts to relate to energy savings and trying to make buildings much more energy efficient than they normally are. But also, it's more social sustainability as well as very important to make sure a whole community works from a sustainable point of view that actually it uh, allows it to function as a sort of whole community rather than just being um, something that exists only in one dimension. London and China, Eco Build is in India now. Uh, what do you have to say about that? I think Eco Build here is great. It's great to see um, India having its own Eco Build conference. I mean, I think it's so critical around the world now to make buildings energy efficient, to be more aware about global change, climate change, global warming. It's really important to, uh, to architects. And I think to actually have products here that actually start to tackle that, I think, is, is fantastic. And I think it's um, I'm sure it's going to be bigger next year and bigger and bigger in the years after that. I think it's, uh, it's great to see it here. And the one in, in London was massive. The one in China, I think, was, was as big as well. But I think this is um, it's very important that India takes on board the, the whole idea of making buildings very, very energy efficient and uh, ecologically um, sustainable because you, know, you have a growing population and it's very important, in fact, that you don't make the mistakes we've made in the West. So what is the way forward then for India to make a sustainable movement stronger? I think it's a matter of really being aware that actually there are other ways of doing things rather than just being the lowest, <coughs> lowest price denominator. I think it's very important to make sure that um, you always look for the alternative solution that's green. You know, your population is, is nearly the biggest in the world in terms of the country, but actually you're only using 5% of the world's CO2, which is, is good, but I think you know, if you start to increase the amount of CO2 you produce to the levels of America per, per head, you know, we have no planet. So I think it's really important you take it on board and actually um, it becomes much more part of the way you work. You know, for us as, as architects, it's not a sort of additional layer that we apply to, to things. Actually, it's the way we actually work is actually to, to design things that are um, energy efficient, sustainable right from the outset. It's not just applied afterwards. Thank you so much.